Making sure that he lost aggro. To feel like a stranger. What? Another one of you works looking from the green in the back. Room. <laughs> yeah, I love this song. <laughs> A Scottish, Irish, Polish, Native American, and the rest is unknown because father is unknown. Wow. Okay. Quite the eclectic mix. I know there's a decent amount of um, Welsh in me. Obviously English. Apparently some Gypsy. Apparently a little bit of French and some others. Like yeah, I'm like a sperm cocktail hey. man. Hey. Boy, <laughs> we got beer. If you ain't buying beer, you ain't buying. Look, he's British. You got a little flag and everything. Oh, beautiful way. Isn't that the American? Anthem? I don't know. It's a, uh, a thing over there. God save the queen. Happy and glorious. God save the... I don't know my own national anthem. And you know what? I have no shame for that. I don't care. Uh, do you know Imogen Cabot? Oi, Cabot. I'm talking to you, Gov. I'm talking to you, Gov, as well. He's got a bowler hat and everything. He's a stereotype. Lovely. Name we all wear bowler hats. Kind of balmy. Haven't seen her in a while, though. Try Magnolia. She likes to make friends with people. She might know more about this missing bird. Magnolia! This guy wants a word! He sounds a bit like... And I forget his name right now, even though he's a very famous actor and I should remember his name, but he sounds like a bit like the dude from Who Framed Roger Rabbit. I don't know why his name is escaping me right now. He I do know his name, gate, but it's, it's left my head. Because I'm awful with light, man. You're mm. not going to sing no more? What's the matter, handsome? Don't tell me you didn't like the song. Okay, she's done. I know you're watching the Royal Wedding. No, I don't even know anything about it. I actually couldn't even tell you the name of the woman who married ha Harry. It was Harry, right? It was yeah. Harry's the younger, the the more ginger one with the more hair. More hair, more ginger, younger, smaller. Yeah, it was Harry. Oh no, yeah, I know who he married. It was like no, actually, I I have no idea what her you name is. Genuinely. Your voice? Uh, I've never heard that song before. Who wrote it? I think I remember she says it was her, but I'm gonna ask her anyway. I did. Everything I sing is an original. Now there's something special about you, isn't there? Don't tell me. Let me guess. Ah, of course. It's those powerful muscles of yours. It's very blue eyes. My. I could get used to looking at those. So what brings a man like you to my part of town? You'll have trouble looking at them through the paper bag that I'd have to put over your head. <laughs> uh, sticks of sledgehammer. Yeah, I know. Uh, you should do an Oblivion Let's Play Heavily Modded. I did, actually, like, many years ago. Um, I might do another one, to be honest, because there's a lot of <clears throat> mods for Oblivion that I haven't played. And I, wa I did say I wanted to do, like, the... Um, the you one where you combine a bunch say. of the overhauls, like one of them's Try Oscuro's hunt. Oblivion overhaul, and you can combine it with like three other overhauls, and it makes the game kind of crazy and all this stuff. And it's really hard to get it to work together, but I've always wanted to do that. So at some point, I may do it with those overhauls together. I don't know. Um, what do you think? Oh, I woke up here, just me, my underwear, and my regret. We'll go with that. <laughs> that sounds like the beginning of a great song. I think you and I are going to get along. So it's my turn to answer questions, right? What can I do for you? Who is your daddy and what does he do? I was wondering if we could get to know each other a little better. Wink, wink. Oh, really? I have a paper bag in my back pocket. A bar round one. You, me, an evening under the street lights. It's the only life I know. Right now. When I met, I know the words. Real life. I think something else as well. And then what? Sex. Music. Apparently. Hmm. I knew you were something special, all right. Let me get my coat. Yeah, I'm sure most of you know more about the royal wedding than I do. I, I, I couldn't give a shit. Like, no offense. I'm sure they're nice people. I just I don't give a shit about the royal family. Like, it, it, they're, they're inconsequential to me. Um, you know. Uh, do you know Imogen, <clears throat> excuse me, Imogen, yeah, there goes the voice, oh, hang on, I gotta mute, hold on, hold on. Hello, okay, voice is kind of back, that was rough. Alright, do you know Imogen Cabot, let's Take get out of here, I wouldn't mind hearing another song. Writing a song in my head. In bed. 
A good musician listens to her audience. How about this one? Hey, Bailey, thank you for the raid. How did your stream go, buddy? Uh, okay. Apparently, I, I didn't actually want you to sing. I was, I was just, I was just flooding. Oh, God, she's gonna sing. Like an earthquake, starting to roll like happens if I push her again? Out of control like a world war starting to brew Baby, it's just you Hang on, I, I, I gotta turn around like oh, It's so hard to move in third person How do people play like this? I, got my mind I, get, I can't centralize my character There you go, kind of It's a beautiful song Cause baby, it's just you Yeah, it just, just stops it, alright <laughs> Wait, why are these candles floating? Wait, hang on. What? Oh, I broke her. Alright, and we need to push her out this corner. She's broken. Okay. <laughs> oh, Christ. What up, Bailey? Is she gonna start again? <laughs> no, she might. What is that? Oh, it's just the floor. Alright. Alright, I think I broke her. Did I save before I pushed her? I think I did, right? Oh crap, no I did. No I did, okay. We're gonna reload, because I broke it. It may break it again, uh, me uh, reloading in the middle of her song. But we'll see. Okay, no, we're good, we're good. Bro, Grimrock 2 was streaming that? Nice. How'd you like it? Like an I guess we should let her sing, since I apparently asked her to do it. Let's get. Damn it. Damn it. No one steal this. You know what? I'm taking my fusion core. Running from something? Hey, right, let's get drunk in the meantime. You ever get that Stay thing free, done. man. What like thing? You know. Things. I got my thing with the things. Oh, right. That. Oops. Yeah. You'll be coming for a regular. Well, the beer's still tasting the same. Like shit. You leave me breathless. I like this guy. Who's this singer? That is Magnolia. Flower of the third rail. Anything you want to know about her other than that is her business. Now, you're going to order? The third row is this your place. What? Ah, God. Please. Croup Manor is under attack. I, I don't I don't remember where that is, I'll be honest. Zancox. I don't really care. Oh, Charlie just keeps the floor clean. The drink's dirty. <laughs> so, you're buying a what? Nice, I'm glad you like it, Bailey. The far first phase is sucking so much arse you hate lasers. Which one is the first phase, isn't that? Oh yeah, it's like where you're in the room and there's like three pillars or whatever that he teleports onto or something like that. Dude, you're making me want to play Kingdom Hearts. So Hancock's the owner. What a funny name. That's right. Owner and like mayor Hancock. of this whole bloody town. Cock means penis. Trust me, never it's get funny. on his bad side. Oh, and, uh, stay clear of his bodyguard. So watch your poison. Use a half boarded to play my mod. Well, hopefully you like it. Again, I got a lot of work to do in it. I actually, um, pretty much completely rebuilt the very first area of my mod. Uh, because when, when compared to the later areas that I've been building, it was very basic and not... Paying attention to what? Not particularly interesting. Uh, so you know, I've been I've been re-going over old areas to make them better. I think I've done a pretty good job so far. Hancock has a bodyguard. Yeah. This is a long song. Red Christ, still going. The condescending stare. Trust me, Cub, something about her ain't right. But I'd never admit saying that. I'm trying to sell drinks here. You in? He says gov a lot because he's a British red box. What's the word around sound? Well, they say there's a newcomer around here who doesn't understand that I'm a bartender, not a damn new spot. Oh now, God. are you going to drink? So bloody angry. Um, uh, let me see what you got. Cash up front. No tabs. I'm good for it, don't worry. I killed many a man and robbed many a body. You have nothing good, though. You can shove it. Why do you have random blowfly meat? Disgusting. Now that you're licking up, got a proposition for you. I'm not licking up. I need a dirty boy to oh, I'm do a dirty some boy. dirty, dirty work. Dirty, dirty work. Blood on the pavement. Yep. Bodies in the ground. That kind of thing. Yeah, I could do Just that. I want to hear the details first. 
I got a certain anonymous client who's paying top dollar for a clean-up job. Three locations. Everyone inside. No witnesses. Only catch? It's all in town. The old warehouse, so I can't use my regulars. Too noticeable. That's where you come in. The job's 200 caps. Payment after it's done. And don't worry. 200? Oh, what it is. That's crap. We'll negotiate in a minute. See, here's the thing with streaming me making the Grimrock mod, is it won't be interesting. Uh, I'll tell you why in a second, but hold on. And also there's also the fact that at least some people, probably not many, but at least some people that will watch it are likely to play it. You know, if you're willing to watch me make a Grimrock mod, you're probably going to be one of the people who's hey, going to play it. Attention to what? So I don't want to spoil where all the secrets are and how everything works, because I'm trying to make it quite complex in terms of some of the mechanics in the game. So I want even people that are familiar with Grimrock 2 to be able to play it and be like, oh, there's new stuff here, this is cool. That's the plan, anyway. Uh, don't do work unless I know who's paying the bills. Three locations, that's a lot of time, hey, a lot of bullets. Paying attention to what? Bullets cost money. Catch my drift. Well, I guess we could sweeten the pot a bit. Two fifty. Two fifty. Too low barely covers the risks to my ass. All right, go. That's a big ass. Three hundred. More money, Charlie. Giving me a right kick in the elbows. <laughs> make it four hundred, but that's as high as I'm going. You know, I've never heard that phrase before, and I instantly know what it means. Though, I don't do work unless I know who's paying the bills. All right, Gov. Not like it's a big secret. Well, bad represent. beauty. How are you? How is Mayor Hancock is fronting the caps. Internal political struggle. Fronting the caps. It is. Look, it's nothing you need to be concerned about. Just clear out the warehouses and get paid. Simple. I'll get it done. <laughs> you better. What I'll do? Now go out there and bust some heads. They call me Sell It Bang because I clean up. Dirt, I guess. Uh, okay, so here's the thing. Need Regarding... a place to stay? Try Hotel Rexford. Smell that. Thanks for your advice. That's Regarding free. the Grimrock mod, um, life, man. <clears throat> again, not only do I not want to spoil stuff, uh, but also there's the fact that something I can do for you, handsome. Uh, it will be boring because quite often when I'm making, and let me do this so she doesn't keep going. Uh, why are you staring at me? Because it's really, you know, I know, I know what like Bethesda put in for emotion, but it actually just like annoys the shit out of me. Uh, here's the thing. Quite often when I'm making the Grimrock mod. I spend a lot of time putting down like a tree, loading into the, the game, like pressing the play button, seeing if the tree looks good from that angle, <laughs> and then being like, hmm, maybe I should put a rock next to the tree. Maybe I should put a log down. And then I'm like, uh, let me rotate the log. And then I'm like, ah, I put the rock on the right, I think it looks better on the left. Because a lot of what I'm trying to do is the visual design. I want you to, where pretty much wherever you're standing, generally speaking, I want it to look good and look natural, which is bloody hard to do to also make you get, make it functional. So it's really hard for me to, like, I'm trying to pull off interesting visual design, natural visual design, but also functionality. So it's quite a lot of me putting down a tree, clo like clicking the, the stop button, moving the tree, pressing the play button again, <laughs> like, you know, yeah. Most people ain't gonna want to see that, and that's the thing as well. Quite often, I do it uh, when I'm doing other stuff. You know, like I do it between matches when I'm playing Rainbow Six, or I do it when I'm talking to someone on Discord or what have you, or if I'm on the phone with a girlfriend, etc., etc. So you know, it's it, quite often I couldn't even stream a lot of it, even if I wanted to. So there you go. Uh, do you know Imogen Cabot? Uh, let's get out of here. Let me get my coat. Yeah, let's let me get my coat. Uh -huh. You're gonna get laid. Stream went well. I feel so much better today. I'm glad you feel better. By the way, I need your Discord. I um, am hold on. Invite. Copy. Did I actually copy that? Yes, I did. Uh, anyone is welcome to join if you are in the stream. If you are a regular on Not YouTube on and you want to join the Discord, message me. Thank you. I'm afraid my first love is always going to be the stage, though. I hope you understand. I just can't get too attached. Do we have sex yet? I'll we see did, you right? Around, good neighbor. 
Oh yeah, we totally do. When I'm up there singing, mm, I'll be thinking of you. She's not my type at all. She's like kind of too thin. I think her breasts are fake, and I don't like bangs. Like the we we call it a fringe in the UK. I don't like the fringe. Oof. Oh, rough. Anyway, so he said a right kick in the Alberts. My assumption is that is Cockney rhyming slang, like Albert Hall. Ball. So Albert Hall's balls. A right kick in the balls. That's where I'm thinking they're going with that, because the Royal Albert Hall is like a big thing in the UK. So I think that's why that's about. Why am I still getting a, a thing to talk to you? I'm even tired I'll see you around good Hey, Magnolia, you're named after a color. Or is it a flower? Magnolia is a color, right? I'm pretty sure. I, see, the reason I'm questioning is it because there's always paint called Magnolia, right? But I never know if that's because it's named after a color or if it's named after a flower, because quite often paints are named after flowers. And there's also the fact that there's stuff like violet. Violet is both a flower and a color. It's just confusing, you know what I'm saying? Okay, first things first. Wait, wait, wait. Oh. Sorry, buddy. Uh, oh god. Oh, oh dear. I just realized where the shit is my power armor. Oh god, no. Uh, I left it behind somewhere. Crap. Not in the memory den. Okay, where were we? Oh god. Where were we? Where were we? Were? Let's try and open up the local map. Why do that? Why is R the local map? Well, oh, this is this is the worst local map I've ever seen in my life. Options around, let's say house, but rah, rah. I can barely tell like which is a building and which is not. Yeah, it doesn't tell me that much. Uh, I, yeah, I gotta be a lot more. The bar. Well, well yeah, but how do I get to the bar? Right now. <laughs> my arm is gone because we went and got laid. Where was the bar? Not the hotel, surely. There's the memory den. How did I get into the bar? Clearly, I don't remember. Also, we are in the bar. Um. It was a good neighbor, right? Like, it had to be. You were just in it. Well, yeah. But, uh... Which one is the bar? I have no idea. Because we came out the hotel, right? The hotel's not the bar, surely. Oh, hang on. Is it back here? Maybe it's back here. I clearly Get don't lost. remember... Oh shit! Oh shit! My health! Oh god, you're blocking me! Alright. That was. I was expecting that. Bloody hell. Alright. Okay. Good work, fellas. Slacks. Are those new slacks? It's the third rail. Okay. I still don't know where that is, but hopefully we'll find it. Maybe. It doesn't seem to be back yet. Why are these guys here? What is this? Is this worth it? Well, it's worth enough. Silver pocket watch. What the hell was that about? Why were there just dicks here with gun? Like, did they murder him? Oh, they did murder a man. Okay. So we we interrupted them committing murder. He passed it like twice. You know, I'm not surprised. I am really bad with directions. Good rail. Like, okay. That's the old state house. It's not the hotel, right? I see your message is a long one. Let me check. I don't think it came out. Oh no, there it is. The only thing that sucks is that you do not have the guard ability, so Arrow is saving your ass so hardcore right now. And you should do live streams of the remixes, by the way. I thought about it. I thought about it. The Stay is, free, man. Kingdom Hearts doesn't really do well. Oh, it's mar it's literally the one with the marker. I figured because it had the marker, that's not where we're supposed to be going. I am an idiot. It's okay. Um, yeah, the thing is, Kingdom Hearts has never done well in viewership on my channel. So I think that's why I never really bothered to go back to it. Having said that, I will most likely Charlie still... The drinks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I will most likely still play Kingdom Hearts 3. Same thing with Red Dead Redemption 2. I get the feeling Red Dead Redemption 2, kind of like God of War, will be incredibly oversaturated, and thusly not yeah. that many people will watch it. Better Plus, you know, a lot of people are going to want to play it. So. But it's like, it's Red Dead Redemption 2. I have to play it when it comes out. You know what I'm saying? I don't really have that much time to play games off-camera. Uh, yeah, especially not now that I'm making my bloody Grimrock mod. So, eh, pretty much unless I play it on camera, it, Rainbow Six aside, because it's like a multiplayer thing, I just don't have the time. So, yeah, basically. Oh, well, I'm rambling. You get you get the point. You missed my ineptitude. Well, here it is in full force, baby. 
Adam Cole, bye bye. What time is it? Oh, it's late as shit. It is midnight almost. Yeah, we do have to end pretty soon. We've been going for like an hour and a half. We'll see if we can get up to like two hours, but yeah, the, I, I gotta go like fairly soon. Got a lot of stuff I need to do before the morning. Uh, wait, why is there still a marker inside here? What were we supposed to be doing? Why it? Optional ask? Oh, I can ask around, okay. You know what we should do that, because we don't know where we're going, so... Yeah, shouldn't have left. I got my armor and then got all excited, and then went on autopilot. We may be getting to... Well, yeah. Stairs. Apparently, three is due soon, but we'll see. I... You know, it's Square Enix. It would surprise me if they delay it. That's what they don't. To kill or be killed. Because it's already been forever, but Final I wouldn't be surprised. Weapons. What up? Something I can do for you, handsome? No, you've already done plenty. Why is your hair like gray now? What the hell happened? Oh. It's full of semen, isn't it? Do you know Imogene Cabot? Imogene? Sure. Imogene? I know her. I haven't seen her in a while, though. Are you a friend of hers? I don't know if it's true, but I heard the other day. Again, this might, might be bollocks. I heard the other day that apparently, uh, Final Fantasy VII remake is due like 2023 or something. Like, I hope that's bollocks, but I wouldn't be surprised. Do you know where I could find her? I just need to talk to her. It's not important. It's still, Take where she time. is? Damn it. She's not a friend of mine, honey. Just someone who stops into the club from time to time. Now. If you'll excuse me. Yes? People were invited into the hands-on playing demos. Well, I mean, that's a good sign. Why is she I'll constantly have a marker above Jerry. her head? You're looking for Better me? Better sell hey. some of the daisy. What can I do for you? Back off from my woman, all right? I've already mocked her. Ain't chance I could steal you away for an evening? No! We need to stop having sex with this woman. This is just, like, not getting us anywhere. Nope. Bollocks is right. I don't think that would be a good idea. Maybe if we keep something else, keep I can nailing help you her, with. then she'll tell us stuff. No, never mind then. All right. You have a good one. She's she's had her fill and she wants no more. Um. You step through the gate. You got balls. Okay, Drifter. You, yes? you keep wanting to talk huh? to me. Do you know where Imogen is? No, she's gonna say. What about ah, the bartender? So you're back. Drinks in my pleasant company still available. In the Alberts. Uh, you got nothing either. God damn it, man. Stop crowding up my bar. Bloody hell. All right, hang on. Find Imogen. Optional. Ask around the third rail. This is literally where we are. Who else can I ask? Probably not the generic drifters. Hey. There's a bloody You're spaceman. Blind, light, man. Yes? <laughs> and a girl from Mad Max. Hello. You have creepy eyes when there's like red light shining on them. Yeah. Hmm, one of you has to stand out. One of that has to one of You're you running has to from something? I thought Welcome your name. Home. I legit look at look at I legitimately thought her name was Couch. I'm not kidding. I was like, that's a weird and then I realized. Uh what up Kaiser? How's it going, dude? Arabia nights. Hey. Who's fisherman gear, bloody hell? Like Arabian days. More often than not, hey. are hotter Can't than hot. I'm surprised to find you in a dump like this, McCready. I was wondering how long it take your bloodhounds to track me down, Winlock. It's been almost three months. Don't Pick tell me you're getting rusty. Should we Damn take it. this outside? It ain't like that. I'm just here to deliver a message. Well, they can't be in case moved. you forgot, I left the gunners for good. Yeah, I heard. But you're still taking jobs in the Commonwealth. That isn't going to work for us. I don't take Not orders from you. Hey, you Not you anymore. That thing so why don't you take your girlfriend and walk out of here while you still can? Being sneaky. What? Winlock, tell me what's going on. Listen Twinsies. to shit. Listen up, McCready. The only reason we haven't filled Twinsies. your body full of bullets is that we don't want a war with good neighbor. See, we respect be a problem other box. people's boundaries. Wait a minute. We is know this how to play the different? game. Up. It's something you never learned. Glad to have disappointed yeah. you. <laughs> you different. can play the tough guy all you want. But if we hear you're still operating inside hmm. gunner territory, all bets are off. You got that? You finished? Yeah. We're finished. Come on, Barnes. Look, pal. If you're preaching about the Atom or looking for a friend, you've got the wrong guy. If you need a higher gun, then maybe we can talk. Why are you... Dressed like a train conductor. Maybe, why don't you tell me who those guys were first? From what I just heard, it sounds like you're out of business. From what I just heard, that might be a bad idea. I'm interested. I think you got what it takes. Uh, let's go with, it's a bad idea. 
Don't tell me you're siding with those idiots. Look, if you got the caps, I'm not gonna let you down. I used to run with the gunners, for God's sake. Ooh, tough guy. Never heard of him. I have, I've killed many, but still. You're one of the biggest gangs in the Commonwealth. Got a rep for being crazy. Never heard of him. You know, so tightly wound, you think they were a cult or something? Stuck with them for a while because the money was good, but it never fit in. That's why I made a clean break and started flying solo. Now what about you? How do I know I won't end up with a bullet in my back? Trust me, you don't. You're good, I am glad, guys. Oh, you always are suspicious you don't. That's part of the risk, right? Exactly. Can't argue with that. I'll tell you what. Price is 250 caps. I'll tell you what, no one ain't. Front. There's no room for bargaining. What do you say? I don't go for any less than 400. Everything's negotiable. Oh, wait, no, this is me paying you. My bad. Everything's negotiable. Would you... 200? That's where you want to, like, argue this man down to? You don't go from 250 to 200. You go from 250 to, like, 25, then he haggles you up. He's like, no, 175. And then you're like, no, it's you, uh, 53. You off somewhere else? Oh, yeah, yeah, 200, what? I guess. You drive a hard bargain. It's not a hard you bargain. You yourself an extra gun. It's a really soft All bargain. Right, boss. Let's get out of here. What a crappy negotiator I am. Medics don't really need it. Uh, it's not worth trying to steal it. Alright, let's get out of here. I can't be bothered. I'll just get bloody caught and then constantly uh, reprimanded. And they'll be like, Oh, you're yeah. not going to reload the game. Hey. Why do you still have a marker above your head? What is up with this? I don't understand. What the hell? Paying customers only. Hello again. Something you I don't can need do to stand you? up to talk to me, lady. You can just sit down. Oh, we'll just do another song, I guess. Bloody hell. All right. I can try another We all know you insist you. on it. You stuck up bitch. They stay free, man. Sweet pit boy, brother. Sweet oh, eyeball wow. helmet, brother. I got a couple of those myself. Yeah. Sweet comb over thinning on top thing, brother. All right, let's. I don't know what I don't know why there's a marker on her head. It's weirding me out. What are we doing? What the Christ has got? What are we doing, McCready? What do you want? I don't know. What are we doing? Yeah? I seem to have no destination. I think we need some time away from each other. How would you feel about our relationship, buddy? Well, partnering up with you sure beats drinking myself blind and good neighbor. I think I maxed that charisma, Kaiser. Okay. Where do I go? Does anyone know? Like, what, what on earth am I supposed to be doing? She still has the marker above her head, though she seems to be bloody useless. Like, yes, we have a mark of the points inside, but that's that one quest in Nuka World or whatever that just will not seem to demark itself for some reason, which is always bloody confusing. So that's kind of annoying. That aside, I don't know what we should be doing for this quest. Honestly, I'm ready to ditch this and just go to the main quest, because without a marker, it's just kind of irritating. I kind of can't be bothered. Yeah. Nothing says welcome like the stench of urine-soaked garbage. Nice. Like, it's fine imaging. Like, I don't know where the bloody hell she is. But the, all we got is, like, a marker on that bitch's head. Optional ask around the third rail. I guess there's someone else in the third rail we're missing. But, again... She's the only one with a marker, and she, she doesn't, like, we we had sex with her and everything, and we had her, like, sing, like, three songs and blah, 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 and she's just, she's just not complying, you know? There's got to be someone else around here that we're missing. What about Ham? I toss out the troublemakers. We keep that in mind. I also need to change the light on this pit boy, because this is bloody awful. Uh, hmm. There's no one else in this back room. There's another back room somewhere, Peace, perhaps. Brother. Ah. Need a place to stay? We tried the box and uh, yes. regular drifters yeah. I don't Step think are going to be useful. No we tried balls. a couple of them. I would imagine if one drifter is useless, they're all going to be useless. We tried ham. Like, I, I'm, I'm out of options here. I mean, it's Fallout 4, so it, it's entirely possible it's straight bug now. I mean, there is a floating candle in my face as I'm saying that, you know? So, I wouldn't necessarily be surprised. Why is the marker on your head, yo? You again. It's my lucky day. What purpose what do you, you serve? I don't understand. Uh, well, Ben, you are a graduate now, I heard. Congratulations, man. I'm very proud of you. All right, let's, tr let's try this, this uh, one more time. That depends on why you're looking for. Okay, we probably clicked the wrong option here last time. 
Wait a minute, I don't remember any of this coming up before. Whatever. I'm trying to help her. Do you know where she is? Her family hired me to find out what happened to her. The family's worried that something's happened to her. They're all going to be basically the same bloody answer, so... Do you know where she is or not? No need to get impatient with me. I just don't I think consider it to so yeah, gossip no. to any stranger who walks into the club. Rip. I guess I was just too rude to her before, I suppose. Do you know where she's gone? Uh. There was this preacher fellow who used to come in here all the time. One of the slick ones. Always going on about remaking your life and so on. Most Lick of the preacher. customers wouldn't give him the time of day, but Emma Jane... She latched on to him for some reason. I don't suppose it hurt that he was easy on the eyes. Mmm, intense. Some women find that irresistible. You hussy. Pam! Would you come over here a minute? Finally, progressive. Yeah, is there, there a he is. problem, Miss Peggy? Good goddamn no, time, buddy. This fine gentleman here was just looking for Imogene. Do you happen to know where that preacher fella came from? Hmm. Brother Thomas? Yes, that's right. The one Imogene was always hanging on. Had to throw him out. Wouldn't stop bothering customers with that salvation racket. Kept going on and on about joining him at the back bay. Then he'd shove those stupid flyers in your face. Here, I kept one of them. Just in case he didn't pay his bar tab. Hmm. Well, thanks, honey. Finally. Oh, big help. Anything for you, miss. I hope Imogene's all right. I didn't much like the idea of her going off with that preacher fella. All right, finally we have a lead. Good God! Uh, find Imogen Cabot. All right, where is our lead taking us to? Am I supposed to read the thing he gave me? No. Okay, good, because I don't want to. I don't know what he gave me, so fuck it. Um, it looks like we got another freak. Right, just won't. I will give you the else. briefest Enjoyous explanation day. of this because I have explained it several times before, and people probably don't want to hear it multiple times. So the reason I don't like Man vs. Game is because. He, uh, about a year or so ago now, hang on, hang on. So, alright, well, okay. Let me start from the beginning. At one point on Twitter, he posted a picture of himself, and he said, I look hollow, LOL, or something like that. Uh, you know, in a Dark Souls reference. And I believe I said, eat a hamburger. I'm pretty sure, oh no, 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 what I said was, try reverse hollowing. I thought that was quite a witty response. Um, and then, what he did was, he retweeted everybody who said anything remotely like that to him. Including someone else who said he ate a hamburger, I forget. Yeah, it wasn't me who said that, I said the reverse hollow thing. And then he made a bunch of tweets whining and complaining, saying that people were, you know, basically skinny shaming him, essentially. Like, no we weren't. You made a joke about it. You know, no, no one was actually, no, there was not a single nasty comment there. You know, it was all in good fun. Um, so I basically called him out on it. Everyone else apologized, but I don't, I think when you try and publicly shame people like that, especially when they clearly had your best intentions, you know, at heart, you're just being a dick. So I got pissed off him for that, and then I blocked him, etc, etc. Then, uh, god, this air is so bloody for me. Then I found out like a year after that, that he was a meth addict, and that that is why he's so skinny. So it's like... He's making a big deal about him being skinny and all, oh, you know, I don't like the way I look, I don't like being skinny, how dare you all talk to me like this, blah blah blah. And it's because he's a fucking meth head. Like, what a piece of shit. But there you go. That's why I don't like Man vs. Game, because he's a giant piece of shit. And, uh, yeah, that, that's, the short, that's the short explanation. Alright. What up, Brother Thomas? People are Welcome shooting at me, neighbor. but you know what? We're always glad to see a new face around here. Leave, eh? Tell me something. You ever feel like this whole world is broken? Do you ever wonder why things can't be the way they were in the good old days? A little bit. A little bit. Look at Imogen. I don't have time for this. You should make time for something this important, neighbor. Something that could change your life. And maybe the whole commonwealth. We call ourselves the pillars of the community. We're a pretty new movement, so you may not have heard of us. But we're growing fast all across the Commonwealth. What up, Billy? And you can be part of this exciting future. Step right this way, and I'll be happy to tell you all about our movement and how you can be a part of it. 
<laughs> okay. You know what? I'm gonna humor him. I'm listening. Well, that's just fantastic. I know you're going to fit right in around here. I like his little flower in his pocket. How delightful. I'm always excited to welcome a new member into our fold. This is a cult, right? It seems very cultish. Where's he going? No idea. You right are welcome, this way, Ben. Neighbor. No, neighbor. Not creepy at all. Am I the only one that, like, I, I feel like the word neighbor is almost unanimously, almost always creepy when people say it. Like, you, you pretty much can't Don't say neighbor worry. without sounding like you're a serial killer. Alrighty. I, I hope you're as excited as I am. Unless you're like, you know, you're talking, you're saying, like, this person is my neighbor, that's fine. But when you literally directly call someone neighbor to their face, like, you don't say, hello, Bob, or whatever. You say, hello, neighbor. At that point, I'm like, you're going to kill me, chop me up, put me in your basement for storage, because you're then going to cannibalize me over the course of a year, aren't you? This is one of my favorite parts of the job, getting to welcome new members into our movement. The first step is simple. You have to learn to give up your attachment to material possessions in order to gain the ability to have true wealth, health, and happiness. Just go ahead and give me everything you own, and I'll initiate you as a first-level pillar of the community. I've always wanted to be a pillar of a community. I don't know what you mean, neighbor. Yeah, I know. Uh, what's with the one-week break? Okay, I already explained it. It's a brief explanation. Visiting London with girlfriend. For a week. There you go. Uh, I'm actually looking forward, uh, looking for, not looking forward. I'm looking for Imogen. You've got to be kidding. You want me to give you everything I have. I was thinking of it. Here, here. Hold on. Hold on. I'm going to do it. Because again, I want to know where this goes. Yeah. Take everything I have. The oh, hell was that noise? You're really going to. Uh. Welcome. You've made a brave step into a bright future. Hooray, brightness. You're now officially a pillar of the community. So, here's level one. Repeat this mantra to yourself until you truly believe it. I deserve a better life. A better life is coming. A better That's life a hideous is mustache. almost here. Thank you, Once you truly believe that in your innermost self, you'll be ready for level two. That's oh, when two. things will really start I understand levels, I play video games. How will I know when I'm ready for level two? I guess it can't hurt. I can't believe I gave you everything for a stupid self-help mantra. I deserve a better life. A better life is coming. A better life is almost here. Yeah, we'll go with that. That's it, I'm neighbor. playing along. Keep it up, and remember to tell all your friends about us. Spick and span, ain't it? Yeah, spick and span. Uh, why do all the character models in this game look unnaturally skinny or made out of wax? Bethesda, and yeah, I don't know. Everyone, everyone is really slim, aren't they? There's not like anyone even remotely muscular or anything in this game. At least no one that springs to mind. They are all just a bit thin. I mean, I would, I would say he looks unhealthy or anything, but like, he's got some T-Rex arms, you know, like, like him. You know what I mean? Like, no one's, no one's got, no one's got guns in, in, the, in the arm sense. You know what I'm saying? Just, like these are the big. This is why he's my boyfriend in the game. He's got the biggest arm. I like that. All right, hang on. What are we doing now? Not that it's any of your business, but she and I are just me, having a little. Let me just take a moment to say, am I the only one? And maybe this is my mind, but whenever a character, specifically a male, is sitting at this angle, and I'm looking down at them in a video game. I'm like, this looks like you're ready to give me head, you know? Like, I'm not saying he is. It's, like, he's not actually gonna suck my dick. I'm just saying, like, it just looks like it, doesn't it? Like, you wouldn't do that. What I'm saying is you wouldn't... Here's a better example of what I'm saying. You would not be in this position in real life with another man unless one of you were gonna suck the other one's dick, would you? Like, you you wouldn't. Because th it would be awkward as hell. Like, you, you would you would have some space between you. Because... Otherwise, his head's like right next to my crotch. So unless you're gonna use your mouth, then back up. You know what I'm saying? Oh, it's me like that. Trouble. You know how it is. <laughs> She's not seeing anybody until she cools off. You don't, cause you're a girl. Well, I'm just saying, like, 
it's it, he's his head's unnaturally close to, close to my crotch. I'm just like this is this is not a position you'd be in in real life. You would never stand over a man like this unless you were gonna flop it out. Uh, I'm gonna see her one way or another. Your choice. I'm a friend of the family. Maybe I could talk some sense into her. Hmm. He's still got my stuff. He's still got my stuff, hasn't he? Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. Yeah, he totally does. Look at that. Look at that manly visage. That hair that I don't have. All right. Uh, I'm a friend of the family. Look, the truth is, we had a little uh, disagreement well, about I'm tall her enough. He doesn't need to be on his knees. She got kind of violent, so I locked her in there until I could figure out what to do with her. If you're willing to take her off my hands. Let me unlock the door for you, and, what up, and she's all yours. Uh, I've got to warn you, she's way stronger than she looks. It took all of us combined to even get her locked up in there. Got all my guns and everything. She's all yours, neighbor. Where is she? What? What? Am I missing something here? What? Wait, wait, what? Hang on. It's probably bugging out, yes. I, like, I don't see her at all. Alright, hold on. What does the map say? The map says she's over there. At the Cabot house. That's where we were given the quest, right? Oh, this game. Alright, hang on. Yeah. You're dead! Come on! Yeah. Yeah. You and me! Bunch of justice. Oh, my chain. It's my bloody chain. He actually is carrying it. Get out of the bloody way. Well, now you got me killed because you're body blocked. Uh, TCL, she might be under the ground. She might be, but... The market's, like, pointing me towards where we got the quest, which leads me to believe somehow she has magically teleported Welcome, there. Welcome, neighbor. Probably the We're game... Always glad to see a new We're going to redo this without giving them the stuff. Tell me something. Probably the game ever thinks like I've saved her already, so she just like auto teleported there or something. Can I skip this dialogue? In the good old days? Uh, if you didn't push him, I think he's supposed to lock you in there. Yeah, I, I actually Nobody think fire. I broke it doing that. The hell's going on? Uh, I have time for this. You should make. We call it. I'm looking for Imogen. Oh, I'm sorry. He's indisposed. Is she a member of your movement? Actually, she and I are... You know... Was he regaining health? Maybe. Romantically involved. He probably had all my stim back. Not that it's any of your business, but... She and I are just having a little... Relationship trouble. Find you know how it is. <laughs> She's not seeing anybody until she cools what off. Oh, Christ. Uh, I'm gonna see a one or another issue or two as people are shooting at me. Oh, no. Stop it. Wow, you went right to throwing your weight around. I thought Ow. we were friends. If you want to see her so bad, don't let me stand in your way. No. Here, I'll unlock the door for you. Hey, thanks, bud. That's the hell. Can you raid a bastards? Just get the hell out of here. That was a horrible shot. I'm dead. What the hell, man? Okay. All right. I never. I. I. I looked at my health a moment ago. I was like, oh, I'm fine. There's something I died. Well. I guess we need to uh, be a little more careful than I was. Uh, maybe I took more Welcome damage neighbor. in the conversation than I thought I did. We're always glad. Tell me something. Bloody hell. Uh, Imogen. Oh. Uh, doing here. Actually, not that it. Uh, quickly. Uh, I'm gonna see her. Wow. Okay, we're you back to where we were anyway. Your way if you want to see her. Yeah, you let me in before the raiders show up. Go, look, quickly, go. What the hell? You should talk to Brother Thomas about how to join our movement. Find him! Find him! Hello, oh, crap, here we go. Let's make another save. It's Fallout, we gotta make regular save. And by the way, what up, Josh? How's it going, dude? Oh, you stay there, you stay there. Ah, yeah. Okay, that's fine. Now. Is that that's Gage, right? Yeah, that's Gage. I don't see them. All right, good. Good enough for me. She's all yours, neighbor. 
You're messing with the best. He's he's not. He didn't even try. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's going on. Whatever. Uh, again, the marker is probably yeah. It's back over there. I I suppose let's just go there. I don't I don't understand what the Christ is happening, but it's Fallout, so that doesn't really surprise me. We don't me. have anything to talk about. Playing well with the girlfriend. We nice. don't have anything to talk about. All right, well, in that case, you have any reason not to get pushed across the entirety of the world? Talk it. I hope you can swim. All right, let's go. Uh, where are we going? We are going yeah this way. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, he's got on the roof. Oh my god, you hit hard. Woo! Uh, Shut up! Uh, nice to see you. Chill out. You know what killed the dinosaurs? The Ice Age. How are you still alive? Good god, man! Who's shooting me? Stop it! Oh good, they're on every roof ever. Alright, you know what? We need to hide for a second. Uh, I think I have this thing. Yeah, this should, the broadside or whatever it's called, this should absolutely destroy them. Gotta make dinner. Alright, take these bad beauty. It's kind of hard to wing. Because you lose the little sighty thing when you, when you scope in. You gotta line up first. Because if he keeps bloody moving, you're ruining everything, so stop him. Oh, I hit him? Okay. How many enemies just feel really tanky compared to the way they were before? Well, I say really, it's like two bullets instead of one, but still. Oh, damn. There's two of them? Good god. Oh, I've lost me aim. I used to be really good at aiming, like, free aiming this thing without the little marker. It's, it's, it's been a while, to be fair. It's been a while. I think it takes forever to load. Alright, what else do we have? Let's try this. Though every time I shoot people with this lately, it seems to do, like, no damage. It is odd. Let's hold left alt. What? Oh, you're legendary. What are you wearing? This is like a spaceman helmet. Yeah, it's doing, like, no damage! Through that nonsense. I say we just go with, uh... Yeah, this. What? Still kicking? You... Jesus! Did I miss him? You... Okay, that hit him. Alright. Oh, what a bloody waste. Oh, God, they're everywhere. I just want to loot this stuff and get out of here. Leave me alone, man. Ah, stop moving! Good God! You're nothing. Did I kill him? Nope. She's still like, I swear something broke with one of my mods. It seems like the enemies are not taking that much damage anymore. It's weird. I don't like it. Could just be that we've crossed like a threshold in the game where stronger enemies are spawned or something. I don't know. I don't really know. Right, since this guy's legendary, let's try and loot him. There's like a boss chest here and everything. <gasps> An actual weapon, my god. It's not very good, but still. Gimme, gimme. Oh, hey. I was packing. What's that? Two shot maximized black institute pistol. What a, what a friggin' name. Okay. Cool. What up, Super Joshua? You might seem to have broken something. Quite possibly. Uh, you're finally able to make it to one of my streams. Wait. How are things, buddy? Flawless anti sea helmet, heavy dreadnought, bloody blah, blah, Union Jack mask. Gotta have that, haven't we? Could have worn that at the Royal Wedding. Yo, can you, like, just stop trying to murder me? I don't appreciate it. Where's my grenade launcher? Isn't it six? Yeah, I don't know. That, that, I feel like that should have killed him. I think my damage mod might be broken. And it doesn't make sense, because, again, if you remember, uh, like, when I brought the. when I brought Fallout 4 back. I did say they forced an update uh, that did break the like the place anywhere mod. So what it probably did was it probably broke my damage mod as well. Um, and it's probably just that I've only really just noticed it now. That's my theory, and I think I'm probably quite right about that. Though it does feel like I'm still taking a shitload of damage. It just feels like the enemies aren't. So it might just be like it's broken half of it and just made the game harder for me. Though again, maybe I'm imagining it, but I, you know, after playing the game for a hundred hours, I feel like I I have a pretty good grasp on. Look at that. Jesus. I have a pretty good grasp on roughly how much ammo it should take to kill an enemy, and it just it just seems like it's taking way more. So, you yeah, know. I'll, I'll double check up the stream, see if we can fix it. It's not the, the end of the world right now, you know? Like, we can kill them. We'll be fine. 
Anyway, these guys appear to have a pretty cool mask. Death Sand, okay. We already have that. It's interesting in the way though they were both wearing the Death Sand mask. Just get warmed Kinda up cool. over here. Can I push enemies? I just realized, like, is that a thing? Oh, God, oh, oh fuck again. Okay. Well that Jesus. I see him in orbit. I don't think you take full damage though. It's not like Skyrim where you can, you know, like first throw dart them. I mean, this essentially has the same effect, but yeah, I don't think I don't think it takes full damage. Can you bloody stop? Oh god, hang on. Lucio, on the other hand, seems to be whooping ass. No, God, please, no, no. Oh Jesus! Bethesda code. That's true. Like, who knows if it's Bethesda or just? But yeah, when it comes to the damage, I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure my damage might be broken. But again, it seems like I'm taking the same damage. You see what I mean? Like, I'm dying bloody fast. It seems like oddly enough, maybe my melee weapons aren't broken, but the guns don't seem to do the damage they should be. I, mean, like, I seem to be taking a lot of damage. <laughs> Enemies seem to. Well, no, that was no. like three hits. That doesn't seem right. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I have no uh, bloody idea. Uh, God damn it, I want to loot you and you fell in the water. Gimme, gimme. Alright, power five shotgun. Blah, blah, blah. What the hell? Oh, don't zoom out. What are you doing? Oh, because his body's going away. Yeah. Nah, keep it. Shove it. What's that? Couple of teddy bears in the box. No idea why. Me, huh? And now their bodies aren't highlighted. Weird. Ready to murder on this, but a murder. Uh, pretty with a shotgun. And they like really blend in with what they're wearing. Little gas Turn mask, I'll say it. Come out and you're dead. Oh, I'm terrified. Look at me. Look at me shaking in my boots. A single cigarette. That's bad for you. Cause your head to explode. Show your face. Oh, that's right. You have to have your weapon out, I think. I, I believe I did, like, figure that out at some point, and then I forgot again. Use chems. Yeah, I, I mean, it wasn't really worth it, you know. It was just a couple of guys. I knew we'd get him eventually. Is this guy in the water? He's in the water. Hello? I think he's in the water under the bridge, like here. Maybe? Is he in the ground? Scared, huh? You it should be. Like, it sounds like he's right on top of me. Time to reel him in. Should have just Okay, is he just above me? Maybe I'm maybe I'm dumb. Maybe he's been on the bridge the whole time. Oh, I feel like he should have been able to see me and shoot me if that was the case. Can I let me jump, damn it? Yeah, he's not on the bridge, is he? He's buried in the ground. Yep, there he is. We found him. Run out of oh, man. Oh. Jesus Christ, fall out. Jesus fucking Christ. Alright, <laughs> how am I supposed to loot this guy? What is that gun? Oh, there you go. That works. Ooh la la. Hang on. Damage 141. Uh, what is the sniper rifle thing that I use? I don't remember. Let's run them. Okay, it's this. 102. So that is better. Okay. Let's try a favorite then. M82. Muzzled M82. We'll favorite it. Can't favorite it right now. We'll favorite it afterwards. Yeah. 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 There we go. Gimme, gimme. Oh, I don't want your helmet. Oh, whatever. It's always animal. sell what we can't use ourselves. Oh. Yep, 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 yep. Was that Ben Stiller? No, that was Steve Carell, yeah. I think maybe from the American office. I don't know. I've never seen it. I just liked the audio clip. I was like, that's funny. Let's use it. Okay. Uh, what do I have this on? Is it on seven? Yes, okay, so we're going to switch that out, because it's doing crap right now anyway. Plus, new gun, which I think is a modded one. Then again, I'm pretty sure this is also modded. There we go. Maybe it's not my... I, I don't know. I don't know. Heaven. My god, you see how quick he equips that? Right. Gotta go, alright, take it easy, Ben. Wow, look at this. I'm not holding the breath button, by the way. It has absolutely zero sway. I'm okay with that, because I think left alt is a bloody wonky button to have to press, and you can't rebind it. So, I have no problem with that. No problem with that at all. Where are we going? <laughs> like, I 
have no bloody idea. Uh, oh yeah, that's right. We're going back to the house because again, Imogen has apparently like magically teleported or something. It's you know fall out. It's like bug after bug after bug with this game. And yeah, don't get me wrong, I'm sure some of them are caused by my mods, but the vast, vast majority of the time when a bug happens, I look it up and legitimately, I can't think of a situation where I've looked it up and it has actually been the mods. It's, every time so far at least, I've looked it up and it's been like, oh yeah, no, that just happens. And I'm like, ah, oh, okay. All right, calm down, a creepy bloody hell. Area so laggy, man. Good God, Bethesda. Right, so with it, again, we went there to save her. He's like, yeah, let me let you in the room. And then suddenly it tells me that she's back here. So, no idea. Remember the ending of Men in Black? That's the kind of bug you need to fight here. Yeah. Uh, in an egg suit. Sugar. And water. More. More. Why does Emma Jane do this to me? More. Hello. Uh... So, that's not the one I'm looking for. I just realized that was the old lady. It took me a second. I was like, wait a minute. Cabot? Nope. He... Okay, there is a stairwell up. I thought she was wedged in the roof. It wouldn't have surprised me, in the least. Would have disappointed me. But she's behind a locked friggin' door, by the way. That I'm not allowed in. That only opens with a key. <laughs> This fucking game, man, I swear to God. It doesn't make any sense. It's sort of the Jack Cab, I suppose. Can it wait? I was just in the middle of something. <sighs> Alright, okay. <laughs> oh, hey, the microscope came back. That's lovely. Um, What about if I go this way? Maybe, maybe we'll be able to get the key. I think I may have to just force unlock this door. When I say force unlock, I don't mean like Jedi powers, I mean like forcibly unlock it. Yep. I'm gonna, yep, just gonna use the, the console. Oh, look at how nice and clean how this is. buggy is this game? Yep. Good God. Alright, unlock. Unlock the door. Here I am dirtying the place up. Smack myself in the face with it. Everything around here is stealing. Interesting. What the hell is that? Am I the only one that whenever I see something like this in a video game, uh, particularly a game with housing at least, I'm like, I want that. It's unique. I want to put it in my house. What's this? Hannah's rebreather. I feel like that could be handy. Yeah, it's it's popping up like it's special. It looks like the um, it looks quite a lot like the mask from uh, the New Vegas like uh, oh, I can't remember the name of the set, but you know what I'm talking about. The one that's like on the cover art for New Vegas. It looks like that. So, that moment of truth. She's a carpet now. She's, uh... She's become a carpet. Alright. Uh, find Imogen. I... I can't. I have tried. I have tried my damnedest. She is now a bloody carpet. Can't use the terminal. Alright, there you go. I'm gonna shut that door for a moment. We're gonna hack her computer. Maybe this will tell me where she is. I frankly somehow doubt it, but you know, I'm uh, I'm at quite a loss when it comes to Fallout 4 sometimes, you know? Sometimes you just gotta be like, you know, it's broken, let's just move on to a different quest. This might be one of those situations where we're just like, eh, I don't think it's gonna work. I love the hacking minigame. I don't know why I love this hacking minigame so much, but I love it. it. Makes me feel like a bloody genius every time I figure it out. Though, if you if you are too good at finding these, like, symbols, it quite often just removes any challenge. What I've been doing... Alright, surrounding. Oh, bollocks, okay. How many bloody journal entries? My god, you have to scroll down to see them all. Another unwanted gift from my loving brother still, it might be interesting to play around with it. Hang on, 68... 2251. Imogen is like 200 years old. This is probably a really interesting quest. And yet, because it's so bloody buggy, this whole computer thing turned out to be more interesting than I thought. I've been learning a lot from various BS BBSs. BBSs? I don't know. Uh, Jack's been griping about some mistake he made in setting up his terminal, so I poked around until I found the file. 
It would be simple to fix it for him, but not nearly as much fun as watching him try to solve it on his own. Yes. Chat. Was playing around with some new ideas and hit upon a good gag. I wonder how long it will take for Jack to figure it out. I'm not going to read all of them. I'm just reading a couple. Went to see Father again. Went to see Father again. I just showed up at the Parsons and threatened to make a scene until Jack finally agreed to let me go down. I don't know why I keep going. Father puts on quite an act for me, but I know it's not really him, not since he got back from his trip wearing that horrible crown. I keep hoping that somehow he'll come back, that I'll see even a glimmer of the real person again. Maybe Jack will eventually succeed. As annoying as he can be, I can't deny he's very smart. Hmm. I'm going to try to go through all of these so that people can read these after the fact if they want. There's just too many of them for me to want to read them right now, I'm afraid. Uh, but yes. Also, if I miss one, I do apologize. There's a lot of them here, you know. I'm trying to show you them all. 77. 89. I'm doing this so I can remember where we're at. Uh, even though it kind of marks it, but it also kind of doesn't. Alright, there's the last one. Okay, so, yeah, oh, at least you can read that on YouTube or whatever afterwards. Again, I would be more inclined to read that if the quest wasn't just so bloody buggy and just isn't really working. Like, I feel like we're not really going to get the payoff to this. What the hell? Wait a minute. Oh, we've aggroed someone by hacking the computer. Are you fucking kidding me? Dude. Whatever. Well, that was fun. Alright, we're leaving. Uh, this quest is broken. We, whatever. We tried. You know, we, we tried. You. Look out of here, lady. <laughs> Shut up. Yeah, right in the ass. God damn. Yeah, it looked painful. Alright, let's hope they don't chase us. Because, uh, you know. I, I don't want to deal with that nonsense. Yeah, maybe we'll come back to this quest if it ever fixes itself, but now they're aggroed on me and everything, and I don't feel like reloading the game, and blah, blah, blah. Yeah, I don't know. Take it easy, your manager's doing an inspection. Okay. Don't let him see you watching... I was going to say YouTube videos. Live streams, there you go. Makes more sense. So, what we're going to do is we're going to go pick up the next main quest, or at least the very next part of it, so we have a good cutoff point. So we kind of know what we're doing. I think we're tracking Kellogg or something, like we have to get Dogmeat to sniff it out, which is why we lost Dogmeat, because Dogmeat was doing that. And then we get to get Dogmeat and Pugmeat back, which is nice, because I missed them. And we might dismiss the, the Lizardy dog, even though he's kind of cool, I like him, but, you know, we've had him for a while. We might give it, you know, give it a chance to have the other two. We might get rid of, like, Gage or something. Oh, he's my gay lover, so I don't really do that. I want to do that. But at the same time, I don't really want to get rid of Discount Robin Williams, because he looks like a Discount Robin Williams, and I kind of like him for that. So... I don't know, but I think we will mix up the, the companions. We might get, like, the robot Ada back out and try and make her look badass, because right now she looks like Frankenstein's monster. How's everyone been? I have been good. Midnight Fire, how have you been? The hell are they? Oh, good. What? Oh, that's McCready, okay. Yeah, they chased me, okay. No, I had a feeling. You survived that, huh? Oops, that's my dog. All right, well, we're getting out of here. Uh, so let's go back to data, look at the main quest. Follow Dogmeat. Dogmeat has the scent. I need to follow him wherever he goes and hope he ends up leading me straight to Kellogg's Cornflakes. They are great. Let's unmark that. Okay. I think it was around Diamond City, maybe. Maybe not. That's that one goddamn every bloody time. It is the hardware, bloody blah. Oh, I could travel even though they're aggroed. Sweet. Maybe because I downed them, I don't know. You're trying to get drawing commissions, not much success. I am sorry to hear that. I, well, you know, I guess I did know that you were nice. I think I follow you on Twitter or something like that. I can't remember. I think I've seen some of your art before. It's pretty good. You should try, like, Twitch channels and things that want to moot some what have you. That's probably a good way of going about it. I don't know how you... Well, yeah, I don't know. Maybe... Hmm. Is there, like, a forum somewhere? Where people can request like emotes and what have you. Is there a set move attacking me apparently? I can't see what I'm aiming at. Who's Who are you? This is probably a settlement that I owned and then they rebelled, is my guess. Uh, why not? Ain't doing them any. Yo, people, this is not the time. Oh shit. Where's my power armor? You can win this? Huh? I actually have no idea where I left it. You know, we'll carry on without power armor for now. 
And I'll just grab it, because we're about to end soon anyway. And I'll just grab it off camera, because, you know, I mean, it's on video. Like, I'll just look for the part where suddenly I'm not wearing power armor and then figure it out from there. Probably won't take a genius. Does present a problem with you and the guys on the roof, though. Well, maybe the Oh, we got, a, we got a badass over here. Give me that head. He's got a little head. I was holding R to hold my breath. What game do you hold R to hold your breath? Far Cry, I think. All right, that makes sense. Yeah, I have no idea where I left it, but I'll figure it out. All right, so where are we going? Apparently, right over here. Okay, so we we've we've located where Dogmeat disappeared to. Again, I don't know why these settlers appeared to me. I assume they rebelled. Because I think that happens if you don't give them enough beds and what have you. Like, if you don't make them happy, basically. They eventually turn on you. Hey, there's dog me and pug me. I feel like it's been absolutely forever. Who's a good little pug me? Yes, you are. I will try not to push dog me and pug me. If it happens, then it's a mistake. Sometimes it happens. Dirty, dirty ashtray. I guess I talk to you now? What are we, what are we doing? Oh, no, okay. He's still going. Why does it have to be night time? Every time we try to do something outside, it's bloody night time. Completed help defend Krupp Manor. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I did. Yeah. How, many, how much ammo do we have? Not too bad. Not too bad. What's this tank? I know I'm asking a lot of questions. Uh, 50 caliber. Makes sense. It doesn't really sound... It doesn't sound as cool as the other gun. The other one's more like boom, but this does more damage. And doesn't have that horrible sway. So, you know, I guess we're all with it. Okay. Eyes on my dog. That was my dog. Look at you looked like a mole rat. Look at you using your uh your fun town flamer. Gimme gimme. Dark bitch, come back. I could follow you a lot click clicker? Yeah. I could follow you a lot quick I'm tired. I could follow you a lot quicker if I didn't lose my bloody jetpack. Have you made a portfolio website? Yeah, that would also be a good idea. Uh, like I say, my suggestion, other than that, which is also a good suggestion, would be to try and find like a forum or whatever where people request emotes for, you know, like Twitch channels and stuff. That's probably a great way of doing it. Probably a Reddit for stuff like that. Like a... a yeah, try, try and look on, on Reddit for like, um... Like an art Reddit where you can request art. Might be a good idea. Might be a lot of competition there, to be fair, but I don't know. Forty the sword carbine. Ooh, it's got scope and everything. Not worth a lot. Six five five six. Okay, so that's a port of sword carbine. What is the one that we have a nine? Hold on, I want to compare. The one we have a nine is this. That's forty two damage. That one's ported thirty six damage. This is worse. Well, back at me. All right, whatever then. We'll roll with this. Who's a good dog? Me, yes, you are. Are we supposed to go in like a train station or something here? I think. Dog me, come on. Damn way, you. Dog me, stop it. Why? Huh? Evil dogs. Jeez. I thought that was like my dog. Like, you know, the, the lizard one. Yo, I can't click on anything. People move out the damn way. Okay, finally. No! Oh, yeah, another assault combat. Helmeted cage armor? Eh, I'll take it. Alright, what are we looking for, dogmeat? Have you lost the scent? Is it up here? Help me out, buddy. Dogmeat, hello. Dogmeat. What's he doing? Wait, hang on. There's a marker outside. Oh, now he's going up. Bloody AOI. No, he's going back down. What are you doing? I think he's trying to get somewhere, but I think... Whoa! I, say, I think people are in his way. Probably the hordes of dead bodies. Still standing. God, move! Bloody hell. I can't. Jesus Christ. Are you still with me? McCready, get out of here. Well? Uh, McCready, no. Yeah? Too, too many people. Uh, let's call it quits. I think you're making a huge mistake, but hey. Eh, shit, your, your funeral. Face. 
You, you don't know how to make emotes. Well, I mean, if you can do art, you can do emotes. You basically just make a big old picture and then shrink it down to the appropriate sizes. Go to Sanctuary, because that's where everyone is. Let's be honest. It's the only settlement we bloody use. There you go. I'll give you a, give you a free ride. I can't push him. Disappointed. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Don't mean to do that. How about the cage armor? The irony is he has no head. A lot of dead things here. A lot of dead things. Oh, here we go. Do I give it to the dog? Probably. Sniff this gross rag. There you go. Alright, we'll, we'll do the tracking thing and then we'll probably end the stream off that. So we'll get to where we're supposed to be going. I'll give us a good, uh, a good point to begin from next time. I wonder, can I launch dog me? I don't think I can, right? Because I can launch the, the lizardy dog, Boris. But I think dog me just sort of gets staggered, like a robot does. Because I was thinking, I could, if, if I could launch him, I could, like, give him a good old push, and then, like, drastically speed up this process. But again, I don't think it works on him. Which is unfortunate. That's the sound of the game, by the way. It's, like, super duper quiet for me, but I think it's okay for you. Holy fucking shit! Oh my god. That was actually terrifying. I almost shouted really loud, and then I remembered that it's like 1am almost. <sighs> Even though the game's quiet for me, I still had that thing roar in my face. Oh my god. I hate following NPCs, even dogs. Okay, I think this is actually where we need to go, it makes sense. I mean, like I said, I'm sure it's like an underground train station or something. Search for Kellogg. Ah! Uh, tins. I want normal people with cool cans. Uh, dog meat, what are you doing? Are we supposed to find another clue? What are we doing? Kellogg was here, let's find something to track him down. Okay, so there is a clue we're looking for. What the shit? Jesus Christ. Best to grab it now while you can. Okay, apparently I found a clue. Ah, oh, okay, it was the... Wow, alright. Take control away from me, why don't you? We have way too many dogs, yo. Way too many dogs. Oh, look at Pugmy, though. He's so fucking adorable. Oh, look at Pugmy. Here we go. Alright, let's try it. Nah, that's what I thought. Damn it. It was worth a try. <laughs> I love how we lost our power armor. Like, I genuinely have no idea where the hell I left it. Like, I remember leaving it in the bar, but then we got it back. And I don't remember to, like... When did I get out of it again? I really don't know. Why do you keep stopping? Jesus Christ, don't wait. This is such a long mission. Ah! Oh. That sure was fun. The hell of a flip. Oh, boss. <laughs> we ain't alone. I can do this. Leave my dog me alone. What was that? Oh, yeah. oh. Not the oh, day, pal. Oh, it's turned to a horror game. Like, imagine this during the day. Not half as bad, but because these things are coming out of utter blackness, just jump scaring the crap out of me. Plus, the fact they sound like bloody clickers. Hey. Back it. Oh. Okay. Just do the thing, alright? Let us handle the nonsense. I'm going to loot this building. There's nothing to loot in the building. Never mind then. I'll take the gourd. Why not? You're out of your gourd. Okay, so, I, I, I don't know, obviously, I'm not an artist, but the person who made my emotes, I, I know um, for Twitch, you have to have, like, three different, when Attention, you, when you, assailant. Lower your weapons immediately. I remember this, kind of. I know, for example, when you, um, where is there a chessboard in there? Tracking known mercenary. Exercise extreme caution. For example, oh. when you upload a, an emote, to Twitch yourself, you have to put in like three different 
uh, sizes like 128 by 128, 56 by 56, and 24 by 24. I think something like that. I could double check those, but yeah. So basically, you need just like three different sizes. So you know, you make it like whatever size you want, and you shrink it down to like 128, and then you have three different versions. And then, you know, the the person who wants you most will require those sizes. That's basically it. Or at least the, the bigger size, because most people wouldn't shrink them down easy enough on their own. Alert. Critical signs. Alert. Critical signs. No, I'm about to end, but I wanted to at least get to where we're supposed to be going for the next part of the main quest. Because the other quest we were doing, bug it out. Lower your weapons immediately. Okay. I lowered my weapon. Do we just ignore it and go with dog meat? Maybe. No, I feel like we are supposed to do something with this assault drone. And yet... Can I, like, shoot it? Like, what, what do I do? Warning growl. What are you doing, dog meat? What the hell you just went around in a circle, bro? Yeah, okay, so it is something. What do I do? Wait, hang on. Something come up. What was that? Ah, here we go. Okay, ah, of course. Almost didn't see that. Yo, come back. I'm supposed to shove a cigar in your face. There's an enemy on the bridge. Good lord. I don't have a jetpack. Could maybe chuck a grenade up there. Oh, easy. What are you doing? <laughs> I, I hope Dogmeat has the Zen. I assume it does. It's weird because all the other times I had to, like, shove the thing in his face. But he's just off on one now. Don't, don't be stuck. Okay. Now I'm stuck. Like an invisible wall there, what the hell? Alright, I feel like something's about to pop out on us. Seems like Yao Guai territory. And there was one not that long ago. Yeah, it's getting light though, that's nice. Oh, we still gonna need the lamp. Oh my god, it can't be that far, that much farther. Christ almighty. Oh, by the way, let's break one out. As soon as we did finish Grimrock 2, um, and we are basically done with God of War, we need to do... We don't need to, but I'm going to do... Clue, clue, clue. I am going to do uh, the Valkyries, which isn't really a spoiler. You know, Just that word alone, I hope no one considers a spoiler. Basically, the optional bosses. I'm going to do those, because uh, we finished the main story. Which shouldn't take too long, apparently some of them are really hard, so you know, maybe a few streams if I'm struggling a lot. Walking Sim 2080, I know, what a boring bloody mission, I can see why I didn't do this mission yet. Because I think I remembered how long you had to run, and I was like, yeah, well, you know, we'll do that later. Yeah, I'm paying for it. I think we're almost done though, finally. Shave. Ah, uh, yeah, so, anyway, Grimrock 2 done. Uh, God of War pretty much done. So, one thing I will be doing, apart from obviously Fallout 4, is I will be starting Final Fantasy VI probably pretty much when I come back from the week away. What's this clue we're looking for, bro? I have no idea. I have no clue where this clue is. I'm not really intended. Not really fun. Everyone get out of the way. Okay, he seems like dead set on whatever this is. I mean, what the hell? Okay. Okay, good. This is not clear. Find a way in. Alright, cool. So we know what we're looking for now. We just need to find a way in. And I believe... I think I... Yeah, I was going to say, I remember turrets. I do remember. Yeah, I do remember this place. Did you go home in God of War? Yeah, I did that. I did that stuff. Oh, I did that thing. Oh, I can't be bothered to loot that, to be honest. Alright, so I'm assuming this is the way in, possibly down here. Or maybe not. Or maybe. I have no idea. Don't Hello. leave anything behind. You killed yourself with drugs, Help. didn't you? Yep. Yeah, let's find a way in. I think I found it. Fantastic. Alright. So next time we will do Fort Hagen. Like I said, this is gonna be the last stream for a week. Uh, I will be in London with the girlfriend. So, yeah, I will probably split this stream into, like, two parts uh, to go up whilst I'm away, just so there's, like, some stuff going up whilst I'm away. But, yeah, 
So, thank you for joining me. I do hope you enjoyed it. I will see you in a week-ish on that. Yeah, that's about it, really. Go follow me on Twitter and all that stuff. Go join the Discord if you haven't already. I will give you one more link to the Discord. There you go. Everyone is welcome to join. Just, you know, don't invite randos who I don't know. You know, as long as they're part of my community, you are welcome to join. Uh, yeah, so, I'll see you in a week. Take it easy, everyone. Have a good one. Good night and goodbye. Thank you everyone for watching, I do hope you enjoyed it, and an especially huge thank you to this month's 10 plus dollar tier patrons who are as follows. Don Lobo, KB, I'll Be Jiggered, Miss Justice 83, Black Wolf 8994, Billy Nying, Dr. Papa Penguin, Philip Rep, aka Bebop 56210, Grandpa Gus, Source of Success, and Hitbox. And thank you to the five plus dollar tier patrons, as well as this month's Twitch subscribers who should appear on the screen at any moment, and everyone in the lower tier as well. I really could not do this without you guys. If you would like to help support the channel and become a patron yourself, you can do so over on my Patreon page at patreon.com slash LP. Most of all though, just thank you for watching. If you would like to help support me, but you cannot afford to do so financially, you can always hit the like button, leave a comment, that would help out a great deal as well. Other than that, I will see you next time. Good night everybody and goodbye!